The modestly appointed tent of fierce Princess Milenui nonetheless is dutifully organized and immaculately clean. I won't live in squalor. Hey. May moonlight guide us. Terror engulf us. Whoa, hold on. What's going on with you? Never seen you so excited in my life. Death, whatever. What, did you discover a new species of root vegetable or something? Dora, I found him, Kronos, and I beat him. Withstood every trick he had until he yielded and expired. Oh, nice. So then it's over, right? Or what? Well, no, he isn't dead. I mean, he isn't gone, not yet. I have to go, all right? Yeah, all good. <gasps> oh, hello. This is from the Three Fates. The rivers overflowed back there. Come here. How to find my way in the morning fields? Domnoski Traxon. You have it. It is done. Must be an incantation that can help. Now, tell me everything. You found your mark. What then? I reached the edge of Tartarus and made my way into the house, just as we planned. Kronos was there, on my father's throne. We clashed. He lost. But I know he isn't gone, and I was unable to linger there for long. Truly. And you retrieved something from him, I see. We were never going to destroy him with brute force alone, but soon enough, he may yet be undone entirely. Until then, study him. And I shall study what you found. By study him, you mean find him again and fight him? Weaken him? Distract him? Precisely that. Together we shine. Together we shine. Odysseus on leave. You got there. Come here to gloat, I bet. I beat him. I beat the Titan. Well, hardly matters. He's still alive, you realize, don't you? I wasn't coming here to gloat, and yes, I realize. But this is still a step. If I could vanquish Kronos once, I can do it again. And one of these nights, he's not going to come back. Yeah, because one of these nights, I'll get my hands on him myself. Then you can do the gloating, right? <laughs> Rest easy, son of Nyx. That's the Oath of the Unseen. Wisdom of the Ages. The Furies. The Swift Runner. The task comes fast. of night. Cut. The silver spade. You're mine. It just served you well.
This I vow. I swear it, Nick. Fear may spread. the realm. Sealed as always. Into Erebus. Raining again. You there? Dora must be hiding for a bit. The last wheel of the three fates, those reclusive determiners of all that is to come, is now under the Princess of the Underworld's care. With their aid, we may have a chance. concerning doom I have to find Lord Moros once again and call him here prophecy fulfilled rise and shine the fates indulged you after all that is their scroll beside your tent it followed you out of the shadows perhaps it can provide some answers would that it does. The fated list has tasked me with ensuring certain minor prophecies are fulfilled, though says little else as yet. May it reward your efforts at least, but do not expect the fates to always favor you. The bane of our enemy is not necessarily our friend. We'll have to take our chances. I think I know how I can do the bidding of the fates. Great tree of life, please listen to my thoughts. Hmm, yes. Broker, you've expanded your shop. Could make a lovely gift. 
Headmistress, if it isn't inappropriate, I have a little gift, seeing as your personal supply ran out a while back. Ah, the hounds shall lap this stuff right up, I think. I shall safeguard it for them as a treat. And why don't you hold on to this in kind? Your silver wheel? I can have this? Should be of use. More ashes. Trade you. Here you are. Ash of the dead. Don't have the bones. Still at it? Can't believe sucking up to the fates actually worked. That big scroll over there, that's really from them. Personally delivered by Lord Moros, no less. He seemed a little pressed for time, so we didn't get to talk much. Are the two of you close? We're children of Nyx. None of us are close. But we crossed paths. When certain mortals get what they deserve, it involves us both. I can only imagine. Whoa. Nemesis, maybe we could start again. Here, I got you something. Don't need your charity, Princess, or temptations while I'm on duty or off. You're doing this because you want something from me anyway, so here, knock yourself out. Thank you, Nem. Death to Kronos? Whatever. Up and about. Death to Kronos, sir. He'll get his. A word of caution, goddess, in regard to an impediment you may confront when finally you reach the far end of the morning fields. Reports suggest it's some sort of infernal beast. A big one. Our shades had to stay very far away. I can corroborate our shades' reports and add that this infernal beast is none other than Cerberus, my father's household pet, acting on instinct and pure rage. I feared as much, for they said the beast had several fire-spitting moors. I don't suppose he recognized you after all this time and let you pass? He did neither of those things. I have to help him. What is my path? Eternity. I lack the grasp for this. I can do this. My keepsakes. Behold that heirloom storage case over there. What secrets lie within? Ah, there she is again at last. <laughs> I was born for this. Get you, Kronos. Remember me?
Arcana. Sunshine. The Titan thinks he has us pinned, but we have the situation here under control. Just locked in a bit of a stalemate is all. There. Where to go? The river Cocytus winds through endless misty passageways. The wailing souls within its languid waters all denied their eternal rest. Reminds me of home. A gift. supple and strong in the witch's care. Yet knowing Hecate, she must have deemed the risk too great. I understand. I'll try to understand. Cool and brisk. Enough. Oh, hey. Dora, couldn't 
help but notice that my jar collection wasn't sorted properly. I would never store fungus with herbs. Are you trying to subtly drive me mad? No. Although, now that you put it that way, maybe in the future, yes. I, I was working on minor possessions and your mushroom bottle kind of slipped. So I put it back. You put it incorrectly back. I... Oh, just tell me of such things next time, would you? Maybe I will. Maybe I won't. Interesting. Milano, eh? What now? No use. Headmistress, if I may, what is it that you and Master Odysseus are planning? He's always with his charts and diagrams. Odysseus considers our plan of attack, yours more specifically. He plots a course from the nearest underworld entrance to Olympus. The surface? I'm to attack Olympus? When? How? Attack, defend, tis all the same. Patience, Illinois. As you observed, we are still working through some of the details. But... <clears throat> Nemesis has been in an especially foul mood of late. Anything I should know about? I was going to ask you the same. She sought my task, but that's nothing new. Though she's been clashing with Headmistress more and more. Ah, uh, shame it's been this way. Personally, I'd rather have divine retribution with me than against. I reckon you can't just smooth things over with her, can you? I have my doubts. The darkly splendorous Malinui attends a certain thicket of the crossroads whenever she requires time to think and plan. Time is against us. A secret monument tonight, etched with her will and testament, looms tall within the training grounds, revealing its nature only to the worthy. I'm in the inner circle now. Once more. Beginning assignment. <laughs> Head this way this time. There, Dora. You are required at your post, Nemesis. Or shall you take to openly defying me just as your sister does? I shudder to think what your mother would say of you two. 
You have no right to invoke my mother. None of this would be happening had you fulfilled your role as handmaiden and warned her an attack was imminent. Best watch your mouth or I shall seal it shut. You may continue dwelling on a past you were not witness to, or you may do what is expected of Nix's daughters. Or whatever Eris is up to. Your choice. <sighs> you have this. Our good witch there knows you've a mountain of a journey ahead of you, goddess. You hear about our mountains on the surface? Big, tall rocks? What do you mean, like Mount Olympus or Mount Othrys? Of course I've heard of them. They reach up to the sky. I can only imagine. Hey, you look up from the base to the peak, you'll swear they can't be climbed. But, if you only concern yourself with making that next step, you'll make it to the top. To the top? Not even the wiles and stratagems of that resourceful sack of cities, Odysseus, may be sufficient to overcome the titan of time. They say never to underestimate that man. <laughs> Come on. What say the cards this eve? Death. Denied. Faith of my comrades. That's no mere trinket, huh? Set. This is my path. Conflict with Kronos for so long that we've begun to doubt that anything can meaningfully change. I wonder, Flower, can you truly rid us of this blight? I see. and your meat. Got it? Now go on while I take care of things. This is my task, not yours. And I'm disappointed with your dereliction of duty. Are you so desperate to prove you're superior to me? You know, maybe I am. So how about this? Got some gold on you, right? Those wretches ought to swarm in any moment. Whoever takes more of them gets the other's coin. What do you say? Must it always be a wager with you? Come <laughs> on. 
believe I lost. Death to Kronos. Right. Surprised you didn't bail out with that return trick of yours. You don't know anything about me. What are you thinking being this far from your post? In violation of Headmistress Hecate's direct orders. I'm thinking you don't have what it takes to take the Titan down. I do. Now get out of here. Come <laughs> on.